Hi students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com and today we are talking about general awareness syllabus of RBI grade B exam. So many of the students have mailed me and they have you know messaged me on my phone on my Facebook profile that they are not aware about the syllabus of this RBI grade B exam the general awareness syllabus. They think that the syllabus is same as IBPS PO or SBA PO but there is little bit difference right so let me tell you the exact syllabus so first of all you need to read about read the current affairs last six months current affairs i mean everybody is going to tell you that you need to read current affairs from last six months and you can download gk digest pdfs we have gk digest pdf and if you want to skim the whole current affairs for the month then you can download gk digest bytes further we provide uh, with the help of gk digest pdf or gk digest bytes you can you know go through the six months uh, current affairs within a day or two further if you want to you know test your knowledge we provide monthly current affairs question bank right you can supplement these two with monthly you know current affairs question answers right that is very important six monthly very important right then uh, there are you know national current topics like uh, states their states their cms governor their you know state language state animal such topics are asked then cabinet ministries very important from last i have analyzed you know rba grade b phase 1 exam from last 3 4 years what i have noticed that you will find at least one question from this particular chapter one or two question from this particular chapter and like there are 80 questions general awareness or gk section of phase one of rba grade b is very important and it uh, it contains 80 questions each with one mark it is very important there is a 200 mark paper and out of 280 marks are allotted to general awareness so it is very important you are going to find a lot of questions from current affairs that is a difference between sbi ibps and rba exam we are going to find a lot of questions from that current topics current topics related to banking and economy just to mark my words current topics current affairs topics related to business banking and economy you are going to find a lot of questions from this particular topic in that current affairs if you can find you know i release banking digest a very important pdf that i release is monthly banking digest this pdf is very important this pdf this particular pdf is very 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 important right you need to just go through last previous two three months two three or if possible just go through previous three four four or five months pdf for banking digest i provide that it is very important most probably uh, at least 10 or 15 days before the exam i will release uh, you know combined banking digest for rba grade b exam for the phase one and for the current affairs i release i digest every month so this one is important there is no need to write about this because i'm going to provide you know i'm going to write everything about this in the description and please if you haven't subscribed my youtube channels click the subscribe button and press the like you know it motivates us a lot we are working really hard on these videos we are working really hard on the study material what i am expecting from you is the click the subscribe button that red button you see click that then what is important the union budget just read about union budget this one is very 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 important you will find one or two questions 
most probably this time i i expect there will be a question from gst most probably there will be at least one question from gst then i think this portion is completed now further you need to read about financial instruments various financial instruments like treasury bills you know bonds you need to read about those all those financial bonds etc need to read about those financial instruments you need to read about financial markets then we need to read about financial regulators this one is very 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 important financial regulators because rbi is it is itself a financial regulator rbi is there you need to read about rbi sebi irda you need to read about them what you need to read about rbi is what are the powers of rbi powers authorities what are their functions you know organizational structure how many you know uh, you know who is the governor of rbi these are actually basic question you need to read a little bit about the history of rbi the location of offices mints etc read a lot about rbi right very important then you need to read about sebi and irda what are their roles in the economy how they you know regulate the financial markets what are their authorities i mean what are their functions so you need to read about them there are acts there are acts for all these you need to read the basics about that the banking regulation acts and all financial instruments financial markets is there then very important one international organizations sorry for the bad handwriting yes various international organizations their head offices i mean headquarters who are the heads what are they what is their vision the vision of that that particular international organization and most important they are summits was most of that uh, mean all the international organizations like wto imf eu they they have summits every year i mean every year or monthly whatever what are the recent summits you need to read about them the location of any of the summit or the date of the summit you need to read about that secondly you need to read about the vision or you know the uh, the various program that recently conducted by these their these organizations very important the programs by these organizations then various stock markets stock markets around the world and the further you need to read about uh, like the various indices stock market indices i mean which stock indices is index is related to which country like dow jones is there sensex is there sensex is related to which country which stock exchange which is the you know largest stock exchange like you need to read read about that then list of important days list of important days i will provide the link about the list of important days basically i will provide a a complete digest i'll provide two digest first one for banking and second one for you know the static gk and third one if possible i'll you know provide a complete last six months current affairs so this is the list of important days then next one very important government schemes list of latest government schemes yes government schemes uh, okay yes in the government schemes part what students normally do they read about the government scheme from last one year two year don't do that uh, i have seen the exams <clears throat> what they do is they pick the government scheme schemes from last one or two months there are many schemes trust me uh, after the modi government there are many many schemes even the questions are asked from that state level schemes if some state government like punjab government or haryana government you know released a government scheme they announced a government scheme 
there can be a question from that particular scheme so you need to read the latest government scheme last three months four months is enough according to me if there are some big schemes like manarega or like that you should read about that even if they are too old but there are many schemes you should for the important schemes you can read a last two years schemes but for that uh, in general you should read just last three four months schemes the small schemes read just last two three months that's all there are many important topics then you need to read the basic financial statements financial statement you should know how to read the financial statements this topic is important for for phase 1 even for the interview level very important you should know how to read a balance sheet you should know how to you know uh, read a profit and loss statement you should you should know you should know how what what a trading account you know what a capital what is capital what are liabilities uh, rbi expect you to you know you should know basics of financial statements then important there are many other topics actually countries at least one question from countries there you know president capital currencies this is a stipple topic at least one question from this topic at least one then the simple money market capital market forex money market types of market capital market forex then there is fema fara i will provide the notes for each of those topics then i don't worry i will provide the whole list in the description so don't worry about that as of now even if i am writing these topics here but i will provide the list don't worry then those basic important topics like types of atms various types of checks crossing of checks various types of negotiable instruments these are the important topics <clears throat> that you should learn i mean the gk is same as the ibps po mains gk the sbi po mains gk is same as the phase 1 gk of this rbi grade b exam but there is little bit banking here <clears throat> you need to read more about banking i mean in rbi grade b exam <clears throat> there will be a lot of questions from you know latest banking trends latest trends in banking and economy you will find a lot of questions from that i mean there will be an if a news if, if there is any popular news uh, in that newspapers from last you know 10 12 days you are going i am 100% sure that you will be there in your exam in this one month <clears throat> from today till that exam you should read economic times i mean just go through it you will find at least like 20 30 question from the headlines only that is important in sbi p or ibps p or you won't find questions from headlines newspaper headlines but in these exams in rbi grade b exam you will find a lot of questions from the headlines only uh, what is left the you should read about important sports events very important man sports events what you need to re read about here is who won which sports event the venue of event the future venues you need to read about that then taglines of various banks i have already covered all that banking thing here now it is general is going i think then important one you need to read that is very important that is unique here i mean that is not there in sbi or ibps po you need to read basics of corporate laws yes you need to read about that this is unique in rbi grade b exam that you you should read basics of corporate law you should know about buyback thing they assume that you know about buyback what what is buyback the allotment of shares like you need to read the basics of corporate law how shares are issued what is an ipo you should read basics about that i am going to share a exclusive pdf for the corporate law concepts it should be like 30 40 
pages pdf right now i'm working on it and most probably by 23 or 25 i'll share the pdf for the basics of corporate law very important corporate law and basic of basics of taxes very important for rbi grade b exam and you should read about you know important updates about blue chip company big company big psu uh, who is their ceo who is the chairman who is the chairman of tata group or who is the ceo of reliance industries they are going to ask about this and if there are you know um, mous or like big agreements between psus or big companies with the indian government or the state government or you know the other countries they are going to ask you questions about that so i think we are done but there are few topics are left like uh, gdp gnp national income the basics of economics they are going to ask you about that and very important recent changes in the taxations very important recent i mean the gst one is very important they are going to ask about one or two questions from gst and the latest reports from international organization what are the you know latest initiatives by the international organization that is very important it looks like very easy but it is important and a little bit difficult also i mean you need to read about the various initiatives by imf un you need to read about the nato you need to read about that i mean uh, if you are reading just the who's the head of that imf and what is the head of his location that is not just enough you need to read about various initiatives their vision their goals their objectives and various reports issued by the international organization the imf is there unicef is there un is there eu is there you need to wto is there world bank is there you need to read about they actually release many reports but you need to go through the important reports there are many actually indexes uh, indices are there many they release many indices like world happiness and index is there you should read about that the ease of doing business index this these indices are very very important the place of india in those ind uh, indices very important topic so i'm going to list all these topics in that uh, i have actually made a blog post about this topic and i published it today i will provide the link in the description and yes we are going to start rbi grade b you know course tomorrow and i am providing a link in the description this is not a normal you know that pre recorded kind of thing we are having a whatsapp group you know i am sharing all my videos related to rbi grade b and further there will be a test series and what is important in the test series we will be providing a subjective test series for phase 2 we are you know the only only one who will provide phase 2 test series nobody else is going to provide that but we are going to provide you the phase 2 test series we will provide you a proper paper and you need to type that paper it is real exam situation is there the phase 2 test series we are also phase 1 is we are providing already i mean everybody is providing that but we are also providing the phase 2 test series and if you take that course rbi grade b course the link is available in the description we will help you in phase 1 and also in the phase 2 right i am going to teach you the management principles all that management part and also the finance part that is the paper 3 further i am going to help you in the descriptive paper and my fellow teachers are going to help you in the economics part right and at the end of day if you are able to crack this phase 2 exam that is the best part of our life you know it is my goal that at least out of you know 30 40 students at least 5 or 6 or 10 students are going to you know crack the all these phases i am going to provide the coaching for phase 3 for free i mean i mean i would love to provide the coaching for phase 3 i expect that at least from my group at least like i am expecting 6 to 7 students should reach the interview phase i mean i am targeting 10 but that is a realistic number last year there were like four people who reached the interview level and just one got the job i mean out of 35 people just one person got the job but this year i am targeting five and i want you to be one of those five people so please take my course the link is available in the description see you in the course have a nice day and if you haven't subscribed my channel please 
click the subscribe button and if you have an android phone just install my android application that that is gk digest if you search if you have an android phone go to google play and search my application gk digest and if possible give us the five star rating right so have a nice day